first I wanted to ask you something that Generation Z is obviously on and all the time, and that is TikTok. It's come back into the news simply because the Biden administration is actually putting a lot more pressure on China to try and you know get rid of their shares to make TikTok a little bit less sketchy, let's say, um, potentially for all of the users. So many people are on that platform. And I, you know, I'm sure a lot of your colleagues and friends tell you I'm on TikTok. Why is this a problem? Why, why should I not be on TikTok if there are foreign countries that could be potentially taking my data? How do you talk to them about this? Yeah, it's, it's interesting. It's actually an issue I'm still learning a lot about myself. Um, didn't know much about it just a few weeks ago, to be honest. Um, but it, it is a concern, right? And it's something we should have a conversation around. But, you know, let's not, you know, let, let's not forget that there are many websites um, that many of us frequent um, that do, you know, collect our data and sell that data to other companies to use for advertising and et cetera. And so, I'd say the problem of data and social media is a bigger problem than just TikTok. But when we talk about uh, foreign governments like China, I mean, it is something we should take a look at. I'm, I'm not for unilaterally banning TikTok from the United States right now, um, but I, I do think we need to look into it and, um, and, and, you know, and see what, what needs to be done.